Today we're going to show you how to change the oven temp sensor on your range, and it's a really easy job. All you're going to need is a Phillips screwdriver. Let me show you how we do it. Now before we begin this repair, the first thing we'll need to do is to disconnect the power to the range, and if we need to move the range to gain access to the plug, you should also turn off the gas supply. Next, we're going to open the oven door and we'll remove both racks and any items that may be in the oven. And then with a Phillips screwdriver, in the upper left-hand corner, you'll see the sensor and there's two Phillips screws that hold that to the back wall. We'll need to remove both of those. Just carefully pull that sensor through the opening in the rear wall. There is a harness connector that has to come through there as well. And if you find that it's not going to pull through easily, at this point you'll have to remove a few screws on the back panel to gain access from that side. Sometimes just twisting the harness back and forth will allow that connector to get past the opening in the rear. Never force that connector to come through that opening. Try to turn it as best you can. disconnect the sensor from the harness and your new sensor comes with a couple of harness adapters in case you need to adapt to a previous style connector but this one is the same as the original and as well if your original sensor had the wire harness cut and was moretted on with ceramic wire nuts again you will need to access that from the back of the range so we'll simply connect to the new sensor the locking tab engages and we'll carefully push that sensor back into the rear of the range and if need be just push it the rest of the way with your Phillips screwdriver and we'll replace the two Phillips screws Once we have both screws nice and tight, we'll reinstall the racks. And we can reconnect the power and turn on the gas supply and our repair is complete.